Well, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. It's your boy Matt Merced. I'm here with a, a special video for you guys today. This video is going to help out anybody who hasn't figured out how to claim your pre-order bonuses in Red Dead Redemption 2. Now, I'm going to keep this video simple and straightforward and pretty uh, plain for you guys. All right, first things first, what you're going to unlock for pre-ordering this game is a new outfit, a new talisman for your boots, uh, three new weapons, and a and a uh, a horse with a with a pre-order saddle. Okay, pretty simple stuff. Um, to get any of these items, the first thing you have to do is complete chapter one, and you have to unlock the camp where you can donate money. Anybody who's been playing this game knows exactly which camp I'm talking about. Um, for those who don't know, you can see on screen here. You gotta unlock this camp. Now, once you unlock this camp, um. You're going to walk over to Arthur's little tent that he has set up where he's able to shave and uh, all that other stuff that you could do. Change your wardrobe. Um, yeah, whatever. Uh, you're going to just go over to your wardrobe. Uh, simple and sweet, like I said. Boom. You're going to go into your outfits. You're going to find the Nuevo Pariso. That's the one pre-order outfit that you guys are going to unlock. Um, I'm pretty sure that's the only one. Either way, if you pre-order the game, and it is more than one, you'll find all your outfits right here. So, boom, boom, boom. That's that. Next thing, moving on. Uh, your talisman for your boots. This is going to be an eagle eye talisman. It's going to, like, boost it. Anytime you use the eagle eye, I think, for five extra seconds. Or some, some nonsense like that. Um... Yeah, so as you can see on screen, that's the Eagle Talisman. So you can equip that for yourself to give yourself some bonuses. Okay. Uh, moving on. Alright, pretty simple stuff here. Once you um, get into the camp and you do a mission with Uncle, he's going to take you on a mission to go into town. Once you get into town, you're going to just go to the arms dealer where you can buy guns. You're going to browse his catalog. And in the catalog, when you flip through the pages, you're going to find all three weapons that are going to be available for purchase. Like I said, you're going to get the Volcanic Pistol. You're going to just keep scrolling through here. And you're going to find your next Varmint Rifle. Um, this thing is like a sniper, so you can you have the eligibility to put a scope on this thing if you want to. Uh, you don't have to, though. But if you want to have like a sniper, a decent sniper for the beginning of the game, uh, I recommend picking this up if you pre-order the game. Put a scope on that thing. And your hunting days are ready. You know what I'm saying? Okay, but moving on here. Uh, last but not least, you're going to keep scrolling through the catalog. Boom. Boom. Pass the shotguns. And you're going to see your pump action shot you're going to claim for zero bucks too. So there you go. Pick up your shotgun. And now you're ready for war. Okay. Last and final thing. Is going to be your horse. Now you're going to get. In game. At the camp a mission. For Horsea. Or Horsey. Whatever the fuck his name is. And he's going to take you on a mission to go sell a horse. Uh, you'll be able to buy a horse and hunt a legendary bear. I will be having a video of how to hunt this bear down and collect its pelt so you can get a bear skin for Arthur. It's like a bear head. But as you can see on screen, man, those are the horses that you're going to be able to get. I'm pretty sure that one right there, the gray one, is the pre-order horse. So you could just buy that in the saddle once you get to the mission. If you follow through the story, you'll eventually get to this. Eventually, you just got to keep playing the game. And yeah, man, you'll be able to customize your horses. Um, there's also a special saddle that the horse gets. And you'll see it when you click through and go to saddles for customization. Um, it'll be called like the pre-order saddle. And that's going to be the one you're going to want to equip. Uh, keep in mind, if you got the ultimate edition, uh, you're, you receive bonuses for any time you sell items. Um, and I think you receive discounts through stores. But yeah, man, that's the end of this video. Thank you guys for watching. Hopefully it helped you out. Leave a thumbs up if it did help. Um, 
My name is Matt Merced, and that's how you claim your pre-order bonuses for Red Dead Redemption 2. Uh, Outlaws to the end. Stay tuned.